um, isoperic. Mm -hmm. That's sort of an audio vector concept. Can, can one of you take us through that? Yes. How does, how does it work? I think is the question. Yeah, how does it work? First of all, it was invented in 1947 by Harry F. Olson. Uh, he did the first drawings. That's very specific. <laughs> <laughs> but when you, when, when you use uh, the isoperic concept, you can actually get a base which goes uh, 1.4 times deeper in a small volume than it would with just one driver. And it means that you have two membranes controlling, made correctly, two membranes controlling each other. They work in tandem, they control each other, so you don't, you get low distortion, you get a good powerful bass, and uh, it's having the shear one cavity where they work in tandem, and then the next cavity could be a closed box, it could be a bass reflex. In our case it's always a bass reflex, because we get a more open sound when we have an open system. We get more bass from a small cavity? Yeah, you get more bass from a small cavity, yeah, yeah. I think actually the isoperic is a, is a nice one because I think it's one of the it's a tough one to see. Like yeah. you think some some concepts are easy to see, like the like the, the AMT tweeters or or the open the open rear yeah, yeah. or whatever. But that's one that one's a particular one. I think it's a very unique audio vector. It's part of our Scandinavian heritage. When we look at when you look at an audio vector, it's, it's it has a clean design, and it it, 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 it follows a certain red line that it, that that Danish design have been following for the last more than 70 years and we're, we're very 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 strict on keeping this dna tight 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 so we it's not that we don't like to display our drivers we could in the r10s have put two 15s or 17 in one in each side of the speaker but we decided to make a line array of bass drivers in the spine instead because we one we could get better bass distribution two it, it looked better and it sounded better, and it looked better, and it fit the whole Scandinavian style and and and, and how everything was was designed and and made and 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 manufactured fifty years ago, and that's something that we're dedicated to keep. So so this 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 clean this clean Scandinavian style is something that we will never go away from. And and um, a lot of these isobaric guys, they're like, why can't we see it? Can you make it plexi? Can you make big drivers on the side? No, we can't. I, but trust I, the specs. Haven't you got trust drawings? Your ears. On, have you got drawings on our, our website? Or oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's yeah. not what they want. No, no. They want to see the cylinders. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 